Hello, welcome. My name is Jason, and this is going to be the first in our video series of a new product that we're going to bring to market. And uh, we're going to showcase it today with this uh, BB gun. So this is the Red Rider Daisy BB gun. Uh, you might uh, remember this from that uh, famous Christmas movie the, called The Christmas Story. And that uh, funny famous line of uh, don't shoot your eye out. <laughs> so, um, you know, that's a, it's a great movie. And this is a, a lot of fun, this little gun. You know, for kids it's fun. Even for adults, I enjoy shooting it. My son enjoys shooting it. And, um, you know, here's this, the, the products that it, it runs, the BBs. It's a BB gun, right? So why do we have these bullets here? These are, um, these are a, a 30-30 Winchester cartridge. Uh, of course, this is a lever action and many, many lever action firearms shoot the 30-30. So why would we have this out here? Well, we're gonna get to that in a moment. But first, we're gonna, we're gonna demonstrate the capabilities of the Daisy Red Rider BB gun, at least this, this one anyways. We're gonna shoot out a target at uh, 25 yards. So uh, without further ado, let's uh, show you what this baby can do. So safety first, we don't need ear protection because it's only the BB gun, but definitely eye protection. So we're shooting at 25 yards. We're gonna bench rest it, you know, so we can get some uh, really good precision here. Not sure if that one was shot or not. Let's try a few more. It's hitting something. I don't know what it's hitting. I'm not hearing the target getting hit. Oh, there we go. Finally hit the target. Try one more, see if we can get at least three on paper. Let's go take a look, because I have no clue. <laughs> Nothing on the paper. I have no idea. So I'm gonna, I'm thinking it's probably shooting low because it's 25 yards. So I'm going to aim at the top of the target. We'll try that. Come on, Daisy. Don't fail me now. I think we hit the target. Good old Daisy. Hope we get the target. Oh wow, so we hit the target three times. So let's go take a look. Let's hope for the best. Oh we did, we got three in there. One, two, three. I don't know the order, but wow. Okay, that's that's pretty bad. So as you saw in the video, target video, we did finally hit it. So we're shooting uh, low. So we've got all three on paper. Uh, group size is pretty bad. It's 25 yards. So I would say this gun is going to shine somewhere around five yards. This gun would do pretty well at five yards, I would think. Um, maybe 10 the most it's gonna be kind of nip and tuck at 10 so it's definitely a short range got a lot of fun though um, so we're going to now get into the product so stay tuned whoa check it out 
This is not the Daisy Red Rider BB gun, right? This is a Marlin 336 lever action carbine. Ooh, nice. So that makes sense for these babies, right? You know, this is what this shoots. This is a 3030, chambered in 3030. So, what's our product? Our BBs, bullets. What does this mean? We've got BBs for the BB gun. We've got the bullets for the 3030. What do these have in common? Well, I'll show you what they have in common. Like to introduce the BB bushing. Now this allows you to shoot BBs in your regular rifle. So it's kind of like the Daisy Red Rider BB gun in your regular rifle. So you get that, what are the French called? Je ne sais quoi. This is, this is a really cool product. We've been shooting it now for a while. We've been developing these kind of products since 2012. We put a lot of time and effort into it. And uh, well, we're gonna show you the result. So for this one, we're gonna shoot it at 50 yards. It's kind of pointless to shoot it at 25. Absolutely useful at 25. We just wanted to show you what it does at 50 yards. So for this, we're gonna to have to, of course, uh, use our safety factor here. We're gonna to have to use the air protection because it is uh, louder than a BB gun. So safety first, eyes and ears. So just in case some of you are wondering, we're not going to shoot the Daisy Red Rider BB gun out to 50 yards. <clears throat> you know, I was having a hard time at 25. Uh, you know, I'd have to pretty much aim at the sun to get it to uh, get down to the 50. So, but um, uh, these aren't going to have a problem. So another thing I'd like to mention, because uh, I'm sure you all are aware that these are tubular magazines, so the projectiles stack internally. Uh, so the bullet nose onto the primer of the uh, cartridge ahead of it. So for safety's sake, we're not going to do that. With my uh, personal opinion, this would be a safe practice. Um, but we don't recommend it from a company's perspective. We can't recommend this. Um, these do have a nice gentle rad on them, but they are not a flat nose. So we don't recommend you uh, putting them in a tubular magazine. So it's best to just load them individually. So that's what we're going to do. So as you can see, uh, th this groups very well. Very impressive grouping, actually. It's a great product. It's uh, great versatility. Uh, fun to shoot. As you can see, there's like no kick. And these are, uh, you know, you can load these to different specs for different things. You can tune them, of course, like regular loads. Um, so what we're going to also do, we're going to shoot a three-shot group with the regular ammo. So stay tuned. Just to keep everything on the uh, on the same plane, we're going to load these individually as well. And let me just say, I'm not looking forward to this. I don't mind shooting, but when you shoot the BB bushing and then you go to regular cartridges, it's not so much fun. So I'm going to be holding the same point of aim. are shooting really well.
So there you have it, folks. Um, of course, you've got different heights. Um, this the uh, the regular uh, ammunition shoots high for where the scope is uh, set up for. But uh, same type um, windage, just uh, highs and lows. But again, these other loads are tunable. And um, group size is very much the same. It's very much a one-to-one -one ratio for accuracy. So, uh, so when you think about some of the other products that were on the market, uh, think about the Remington Accelerator. So they made them for the 3030, they made them for the 308 and the 30 odd six. And this allowed you to shoot a 22 caliber bullet out of your 30 caliber rifle. Well, this is a similar idea, except these are a non shedding bushing. So you press in the BBs, takes four BBs and um, you know, it, it, the bushing stays with the BBs till impact. Uh, so it actually increases the accuracy of the BB because you couldn't run steel down a rifled barrel. Of course you would, uh, this wouldn't work. Um, well, you might be able to shoot it once or twice and then your rifling could be <laughs> damaged, right? So, um, very, uh, very fun. These are, these are a great product. Great for young shooters. Great for small game target shooting. So we're going to do a field test with these later. So stay tuned for that video. Thanks for watching. And, uh, you know, as always, if you can't have a great day, at least try to do some shooting, have a fun day. We'll see you again. Thank you.